I got recognized inside Target and it was like just the sweetest interaction and I still cannot believe it. Maybe this is not the best thing ever. taking a shower this morning which I normally don't do but I really badly wanted to do like some Dyson Airwrap curls. I find myself that I like them better if I do it like fresh in the morning as opposed to like showering and doing them in the evening. They just last better in the morning and they look pretty good if you ask me. So I had them like pinned up while I was doing my makeup so They've been sitting for quite a while. I also just like brushed them out and I did do my makeup. But Mary did send me a couple of lipsticks that I wanted to show you. These are their new signature lip mattes. They're a lightweight soft matte lipstick that feels like nothing on the lips. And they did send over two colors. The two colors I got are Power and Classic. And I think I'm going to probably feel classic for today's look. Um, I am going to be heading out to meet my friend for coffee here in a bit. This is how classic looks. It's such a very beautiful color. And this one is power. Such a beautiful kind of like burgundy like red almost so so pretty i'm gonna go ahead and just try this one on just because i don't think i'm gonna wear this one today but just so that you can see how the color looks on oh my gosh that just went on so nicely The formula is absolutely stunning. It's a little too much for what I'm going to be wearing today and just go grab coffee. But I love this color for like a little date night moment. Oh yeah. I love this color. This is definitely like my kind of nude. Okay, love this color so much. This is like my perfect nude. It is just like the perfect like kind of like orangey warm tone shade. I will have a, a link for these in my description box. You guys know I love Merit so much. I'm practically wearing like a full face of Merit. I have on the complexion stick. I have on their bronzer. Um, I have the blush. And I'm also wearing the mascara and the um, eyeshadow. So I love Merit. It's like super simple, easy, like super quick makeup routine. So I will link these in my description box. But I'm going to go get ready for coffee. I'm just wearing my little like towel thing since I've literally been standing here for the past like hour and a half getting ready. Also, this is not dirty, I promise. I wore this the last time I dyed my hair, which was a big mistake because I thought it was going to come out. And I don't know why I thought it would come out because it did not come out. It's just like leftover hair dye. But let's go get dressed because I am running... A little bit late for coffee. I am dressed, let's go get some coffee. I just had coffee with my friend Maddie and it was so nice to see her. I feel like it's been so long since I've seen her. When was the last time I saw her? I think it was it was during Valentine's Day because I actually invited her to go with me to like a little movie screening, yup, of the Corpse Bride during Valentine's Day. So it's been quite a while since I've seen her. So it's nice to catch up with her. She also does have a YouTube channel for a follow. Her handle is at Maddie Keys. I think it's at Maddie Keys. Yes, I think so. If it's not, I'll link it in my description box and you'll give her a follow. By the way, I love this Merit lipstick. I will say it doesn't really last, but it's just so nice. This guy's like totally looking at me like, <laughs> uh, well, that's all right. 
filming myself putting on lipstick but it feels so nice it's like so buttery smooth i feel like when i was like putting this on earlier you couldn't really like hear my enthusiasm is that a right word my enthusiasm no my you couldn't really hear how excited i was for this because i was trying to like whisper and like be kind of quiet because matthew was asleep and i was like also kind of in a rush but I love it. This is like gonna be my new everyday like go-to lipstick. It's a matte color, but it's like a soft matte. But it's just, it's perfect. It's lightweight. It doesn't even feel matte. It just feels like a normal glide-on lipstick. It is so, so good. I love the color. It's really just perfection. So yeah, I also parked like right in the middle of the walkway. So that's perfect for me so people are like what is this girl doing i feel like though vlogging is very like normalized in austin like a lot of people do this so it's probably like all in my head also i spilled something when i was leaving the house and i have this like big ring on my shirt you probably can't even tell or maybe you can and i like got like a little shout pin or whatever and i thought it came off but there's literally a ring and like a little brown mark or whatever it is so just cover that up but I'm actually here at HEB. I'm gonna see my friends Kezi and Arnold and Maggie tonight for like a little game night. I believe Arnold's gonna, gonna have like some other of his friends over so I think there'll be people I don't know tonight so everybody's gonna like bring something so I'm gonna bring like some little snacks or something. They're all on 75 hard. I think minus Maggie she's not doing 75 hard but basically they're like not doing anything like fried food. No dairy I think or I think Kezi can have dairy. Maybe it's just not Arnold and like no sugar so or I think they can like pick and choose. But so I I think I'm gonna get like pita chips and maybe like one or two dips or something like maybe like one dairy based and like one non-dairy based like just to have preferences I think Kezia's gonna do like a like a cheese board or something so yeah it'll be like nice to have like some options I think Arnold's gonna do like some mocktails so that'll be nice um but yeah we'll go inside and see what I can find I did look online and they did have like some like non-dairy dips and stuff I think I might do like some hummus or something it is Saturday at two o'clock and it is really busy so I was gonna vlog I'm, I'm feeling a little nervous. I don't I don't know why. <laughs> Not sure if these are any, but they have chili lime pita chips. They also have cinnamon sugar, chocolate, and vanilla. I've never seen these before. Grab this. I'll grab the bigger bag instead. I kinda wanna try this Orison dairy-free garlic and herb. Let's try that. They also have these non-dairy dips. I don't know if these are good. If you've had any of these, let me know. But this is my favorite hummus. I'm gonna grab this too. Also grab a guacamole. It is currently now six o'clock. It's a bit later. I actually just got to my friend Kezia and Arnold's house. I'm about to like touch up my makeup. I actually dropped Matthew off at work. Oh my god, I did not realize how bad my makeup was like creased because of my sunglasses. Also, like what do y'all do to like not get your sunglass marks here? Because I feel like no matter what I do, I still get marks here. I've even done the powder trick where you put the powder on the actual little things and it like does not work so i don't know what to do if you have any other tips or tricks let me know because that's really annoying i should have brought like a little powder puff to like touch up but i'm here a little bit early but i did drop off matthew at work just because i could have easily ubered because like because like they don't live far from me at all but sometimes i just like being able to like drive and like i don't always love getting an uber like so late like during the day is fine but like when it's like pushing like 10 o'clock, 11, I'm like, hmm, by myself. I don't typically love it. So, drop him off at work. I will have to like most likely have to pick him up tomorrow at like 6 a.m., which kind of sucks. If not, he will like get a ride home. So, we'll see. But I'm like praying and hoping he gets a ride home because sometimes his coworkers like are pretty cool and they like live in the area, which is nice. So, that'll be good. But just doing a little touch up on my makeup. Also, like, does anybody else still do eyeliner in their waterline? I still do. I don't know if that's, like, a... Okay, sir. Like, an old thing to do. Because it can be, like, very smudgy. Especially this, like, CoverGirl one. I've been using the same... Okay, not the same one. I've repurchased it. But I've been using this same exact CoverGirl Perfect Blend eyeliner since high school. 
same exact one i've been repurchasing the same one and it definitely smudges but i used to love it because it has this little smudger deal and i would like smoke it out but obviously i don't do that anymore but i just like i want to get a different eyeliner that doesn't smudge anymore because i don't obviously I don't do that look anymore but i don't know why i always just go to this one while i'm lying i've tried other eyeliners and they either smudge or i get like literal like cry stains of like eyeliner and this is literally like so cheap so i'm like why am i gonna spend so much money on a different eyeliner when this is so cheap i might as well just like stick to this one you know i also still love this lipstick i'm literally obsessed with it it's so good but yeah i don't know how much i'll vlog inside but i'll try to get some clips hello rowan hi honey Oh my god. <laughs> I just got like a clip of like Rowan. Hi Rowan. I know. It's like all Rowan. Okay, so we are with the hostesses. With the mostesses. Is this 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 is? Okay. This is this is this is. So show them the spread. What do we got so far? Kezia, I'll give her credit. Kezia made the spread. I okay. just put it all together. But Kezia, please tell us what we're having. Yes, please so tell. Today we're having, I'm not even like done, but it's fine. Um, <laughs> so a baguette with What'd a you little. Call me? <laughs> <laughs> who, who invited him? <laughs> so baguette. She yes. is. With some Italian seasoning and olive oil. It's, and you had made this last time, like on the whim, and it was delicious. Mm -hmm. Very easy. So good. It, like, Carabas. Yep. So, mm -hmm. and then we have spinach artichoke dip. Yum. With some pita chips. Yum. Pita and then our lovely girl brought us some yep. dairy free because our boy's dairy free. <laughs> and it, it, it looks questionable, but yeah, you know, you, you know. know. <laughs> the best things that taste good are questionable. That's true. <laughs> That's true. And then we have a little a little charcuterie board. Okay. We have Char some. Yeah. We have it's, some some. Herb and garlic goat cheese. We have regular goat cheese, some little strawberries, a little feta Yum. thing, and then some hot gouda. It's really good. Really good. Yeah. Beautiful. And then these. some hummus. Hummus, yes. So and yum. Guacamole, and then guacamole. some extra crackers. Yep. Awesome, guys. Yeah. Beautiful. And then we have our what? drink station for Ooh, mocktails. For mocktails. Love, 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 love. because I'm gonna go to church where my uh, friend Star is the worship leader. I've actually been in her church once before. It's a little bit different though because I was like not expecting it. The church is really small. It's in downtown Austin which is really cool but the only difference of this church is like the actual preaching is on like a televised screen. So praise and worship is live except for the actual preaching so it's a little bit different but I do like it because you can still like have the praise and worship except for the actual preaching. So that's the only thing that I'm like not sure how I feel about it, but I do like the praise and worship aspect and that I get to see one of my friends. So yeah, I'm ready to go and to see her um, and probably get some lunch after. To be honest, I really don't know. I'm like springing this up on her, to be honest. But I'm just gonna, you know, just get ready for the day. It's also really gloomy today, which is quite interesting. But last night I had just the best time at my friend's house. We had like a little game night and then um, they had like a little charcuterie board and some mocktails and it was like honestly just like so fun. I came home around maybe like 11 or yeah around like 11.30 and then I talked to my cousin Melina on the phone for a while. It was nice to catch up with her. So yeah, just like a pretty chill, fun Saturday. I saw my friend Maddie so... It was honestly a really, really good day. And today's gonna be like another fun day. Today is Matthew's like technically first day off. So today is like technically his Saturday. So yeah, we'll see what we get into today. But I have, I like one of the things I need to work on this year and I honestly keep saying this like every year, like in 
I don't know in general it's like I struggle with time management like I wait until the last second where like I have to start getting ready and I'm like oh shoot I have 30 minutes to do my hair my makeup and find an outfit so um I literally have like 45 minutes to get dressed thankfully my hair like looks pretty decent still I just have to like touch up the top layer so that won't be a big problem and honestly since it's kind of gloomy out I might do like leggings and it's like 50 okay now it's 62 degrees I might do like leggings and like an oversized like denim jacket so that will be easy uh, so I think I already have like an outfit in my head I just hope it works out so you know like when you have an outfit in your head and you think it's gonna look good and then when you put it on you're like I hate this so <laughs> we'll see so loud but I'm ready to go and I'm bringing my breakfast with me so windy um had church it was amazing went to go eat at true food kitchen matthew is here now and we are here with our friends star and ike and their baby hope you can hear me over this wind but we're here at um radio what's new yeah we're gonna get some coffee hello <laughs> and uh, matthew also got me some shirts at urban outfitters very spur of the moment but Let's go get some coffee. I was literally here yesterday. I just love this place so much. Mm. I've been thinking about it all week. Really? Yeah, it works. Like, I love their it's coffee. It's just the best. It's the best. Mm -hmm. So we are now at Home Goods, and look what we found. <laughs> Isn't it so cute? Strawberries. They're for our patio chairs. Little us and then we found some other stuff. I'll give you guys a haul back home, but honestly, very good home goods trip. Was not expecting this at all. Doing some damage. Doing some damage, but a good damage. Okay, so we're gonna kill some time because we are actually we're gonna go to Texas. <laughs> what am I saying? Um, we were gonna get Texas. Oh my goodness, girl! Look, <laughs> we were gonna go to Texas for a <laughs> <house>, right? <laughs> Like, it don't though for both of us, right? Because we went to uh, the home goods. Home goods. If you've been did, to South Park Meadows and you yeah, know it's like all we next did, door. We did some damage, y'all. But we got some things that we've been talking about for the last couple months that we've been wanting to get. <laughs> like we got a juicer, a cutting board. Like yeah. I have this like baby cutting board, and I've been so like stubborn about like no, it's fine. I'm gonna use that. <laughs> no, I need like a bigger cutting board. So that, and I'm sure she'll show you. I'm gonna show a haul right now. But anyways. We were doing that. We were in there for like a good like maybe 45 yeah, minutes. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We're shopping around, taking our yeah. time, and looking. It, and in the same shopping center, obviously, there's like a Texas Roadhouse and there's like some other restaurants. And she's like, oh, yeah, let me, let's, you know, let's, I'll, I'll go online and put our names down. And we had already finished shopping. Like. Yeah. <laughs> like we should have did it before we went in, but yeah. we didn't even think about it. So she does it and it's like a hour wait. An hour and like five minutes or 15 minutes, yeah. whatever it was. So now. <laughs> hey. <laughs> so anyways but now there's this place called crawfish atx mm -hmm. and i went in there and put my name down it's like a little less of a wait it's like, like 40, 40 minutes, minutes and it smells bomb like yeah it, it, it just... has like really good google reviews it's packed but it's a less uh less a shorter wait time than <laughs> it's speak. a you know it's a shorter wait time than texas roadhouse and as you guys know we're on our like health journey it's not fried i mean it's boiled and like lots of seasoning but Oh, what? I was tripping out because I'm looking at this at the screen here. Oh, it's here. tracking our face. There's something like on your. Oh, it's just like it's too focused. Yeah, it's like you're talking. And you're you're like, not eh. looking over here. Oh, yeah. I'm sorry. He's looking at the wrong. I'm just He's, like I'm like. Who? This is why. Like, I'm like who is that? <laughs> <laughs> sorry for you at home watching, but. Yeah. Anyways, like I was saying, you guys know we're on our health journey. I mentioned this in my last vlog. Was very open about it, um, but I'm. Ooh, sexy. <laughs> Sexy girlfriend. 
Oh, girlfriend. You never saw that movie where he's like sexy girlfriend. <laughs> it's an eighties movie. Sixteen Candles. Come on. Oh, okay. But no, it's a sexy wifey. Yes. So, anyways, I figured this would be like a healthier. Let me know if is like we're gonna do like a sea, uh, shrimp boil. We don't do crawfish, anyways. But I'm sure this is a healthier option. I mean, it's not fried. So as long as it's like, well, we're just doing like another thing fried. Um, I was gonna get shrimp. I was gonna get shrimp anyways at Texas Roadhouse. Their shrimp. Yeah. If you have never had the shrimp at Texas Roadhouse, it is actually so good and flavorful. Yeah. It's so good. But that, shrimp, shrimp is like it's really kinda, it's high. It's fatty. like it's high in cholesterol. Oh, okay, high in cholesterol. So, I don't know, but but it's not fried, and that's one of the biggest things. We're yeah. doing no fried food. Well, we're yeah, we're trying our best. Trying like, not to. This is all new to us. Like yes. she has this new. Uh, well, it's not it's new, not but new, it's new to but us. It's kind of new to us. And she has this. What is it? Gastroparesis. Paresis. And yeah. and then uh, so obviously like and thankfully like we're trying to figure it out. So like we're just navigating. Like there's certain yep. things like she can't have like certain like seed oils and so and she should stay away from like nuts and stuff like that like yeah, peanuts and, he, and things yep. like that uh, i mean obviously it doesn't like really affect her that much but it just it upsets her stomach so mm -hmm. uh we're just trying to figure all that out so if there's yeah. anybody out there that knows anything yes. you know shoot us a, a comment or a link or whatever yes or send me any messages or dms or anything but yeah. anyways we're still we're waiting for um our table but i wanted to give you a haul i don't know if I really mentioned, but we ended up going to Urban Outfitters where the church was earlier. Oh, you can leave like that, babe. Yeah, it's okay. okay. I was like, where, to you. <laughs> where the church was um, that we go to where my friend and... So my friend's like the worship leader and then her husband plays bass. the bass. Yeah. They're like amazing people. We love them. And they have their sweet little baby, Levi. He's just the cutest. There is an Urban Outfitters like right next door. And I've been telling Matthew, I love the Urban Outfitters t-shirts. I'm obviously wearing one right now and i've had so many like i've had walmart t-shirts like the band tees but they just don't last like the quality like the urban outfitters they're pricey yes but they are just quality is there and matthew was like let's just pop in because you've been talking about it and they like were like yeah let's go in they were 30 percent off which was amazing so matthew was like we'll just get get some so i ended up getting three and i've never seen this one i'm assuming this is new it's such a cute like seafoam green color perfect for summer it says harbor island and it has like a little shell i don't know if you can really see it's so cute and i love like it is very it's oversized but i got this one it's super cute and then i actually wanted this blink 182 one in this green color when i had went i went before and didn't get it i had wanted it but they didn't have it so i ended up getting it in this like black color right it's like black or like a charcoal yeah my wife's not really big into black i'm but she not needs to but like, i i should have like one basic or you no, know you should have like like a variety you can, yeah you can have your like brighter or lighter whatever yeah you, call you know it, different wardrobe. moods yeah but i mean I mean, obviously, I'm not wearing black right now, but, like... Matthew, typically, he's wearing black sweatpants, so... <laughs> yeah, but I, I always like wearing black. Yeah, but I got this one, too. It's just a cute little Blink-182 tee. And then I also got this one, which I think this one is also a new t-shirt. It's really cute. This one's, like, not a band tee, but I love... It's, like, the same kind of... Same style. Yeah, quality. But it has a little bow. It's, like, this really cute, like... Sorry, I'm literally showing in Matthews over here, over like, here like like a dad, organized. like folding. Like Matthews like very organizing, very organized. You're folding them better than they did. <laughs> yeah. Okay. <laughs> Hold on. They if you're if you're spending like anywhere from thirty on up for a t-shirt, yeah. <laughs> you better fold that shit like really good. This girl was like, "Oh my gosh, I love your nails." And I'm like, "I'm like, girl, what are you doing?" Like. Like, get it together. <laughs> she was, like, pretty much, like, she was, like, okay. <laughs> here you go. Like, what the hell? No, she wasn't. No, she was, like, some young teen, like. She, she was, was like, sweet. She was She was sweet. No, she was just, like, oh, yeah. Like, <laughs> no, I'm, like, she... I'm, like, what the. Fold <laughs> that thing right. Like, God. I didn't like it, huh? <laughs> Well, she needs to work on her macarena because she was not folding that nice at all anyways i also got this t-shirt it's like a really cute kind of like raspberry color right mm -hmm. and it's like a purple bow look how adorable that is yeah i, just, I love I like it the quality. i it's love like, it's like comfort colors you know and we're a big comfort it it's not comfort but it just reminds me i just like when you wash them like i mean obviously you gotta take yeah. them but when you wash them like they don't like shrink or they don't like yes you know they just 
stand they, the test of time. They you know? really do. They really, really do. Okay. And then for home goods, um, we got a one picture frame for a print that we needed, seven ninety nine. Yeah, don't worry about me. I'm just struggling. Over there. <laughs> and then we got next our car, next car we're getting is gonna have a little more room. Yes, oh. my um. I don't know my car I'm getting is a small car too. It's a little wi it's a little it's a little wider though. I'm oh gosh. I'm <laughs> yeah. We got our little blind dog a better bed because she needed one. You know, she's old. She's old and we don't know how much longer she has and you know, we're just wanna make her comfy. Yeah. This is the cutting board. Yes. That Matthew oh my goodness. was talking about. Yeah, like okay. It's annoying. Like the and I have no one to blame but myself. I know. Even she was every time we go, she's like, just, buy just a look at the cutting board. boards. Look at and them. And I'm like, no, I'm not gonna do it. It's like twenty dollars or it's sixteen dollars. Anything that he cooks, like whether it's meat or steak, he's like, oh my god, this yeah, cutting board is so I'm just, small. Yeah, I'm always just like, like throwing a fit, and I'm throw, like, yeah, throwing a temper tantrum about it. And then you she's have like, nobody well, to go. blame she's, but yourself. Yeah. And so this last time I was using, I was like, God, that's so annoying. She's like, look, I'm sick and tired of your your mess okay like you need to just go get a, a freaking cutting board so finally it did it and it's yeah. it's funny because today we just like he's like i'm gonna go get the cutting boards and he looked at them and i'm like go look at them like yeah. go back and actually look I at them i wasn't gonna buy one at first i was like no it's yeah. fine she was like no you pick. just she's go like, back <laughs> she was like she's like we're not leaving yeah. until you pick a cutting board she's like i'm tired of hearing your complaint and it wasn't bad it's six, yeah it wasn't bad so this was or a, something. You know, yeah, so good, not bad. You know, good stuff, ready for all the all the recipes mm -hmm. and the juicing we're going to be oh, doing. Oh, yes, because we got a juicer. Because we finally got a new juicer. Wait, it's back there, so I can't show yeah. it, but it's a Breville something it's a Breville, plus Gonzalez. Breville a la chingada. Like we, it's, I looked it's, it up on Amazon, and it, we got it for a great deal. It's $99, and on Amazon it was $170. One, seven, seven, blah, 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 blah. Oh, my goodness. Bro, like, <laughs> I need to eat. Um, like 150 or something. Well, like it was 170 regular price, but you, you know how Amazon has like 20% off today or 15% off or 5% off. It was like one of those deals. So mm -hmm. we got it for a good deal. Um, so we'll definitely post some like recipes because Matthew does like he juices well, and then I also want to get like those last jars from Amazon yeah. so that we can like kind of prep our juices. Yeah, because part of also like the people who out there like who deal with gastroparesis, of which I'm just finding out. Like there's just certain like textures of foods and fruits and mm -hmm. veggies that you they're are that are good. Yeah, they're good for you. But like I guess like one of the things with her is like she digests a little slower than normal. Mm -hmm. So they highly suggest like not that you can't have fruits and veggies, but you need to like prep them in a different way. Like right. you can steam them, right. like obviously make them softer. Or she they even recommend like just juicing. So that's why mm -hmm. like I mean we've always juiced or we've always gotten uh go gone out and got juices yeah, like but now with juice land or like even before yeah. you go to the whole foods bar yeah, the juice bar or or i would like juice at home yeah. or whatever but the one i had was played we out did, it was like an well, old got, we got rid of ours when we moved here yeah, and we haven't had a juicer just, since yeah we've been looking so but i mean we go out pretty much like every other day getting juices yeah and, stuff. and it does add up the juices yeah. i mean even buying stuff to juice at, yep, in general yep. is expensive but you know we're gonna try to do like more of like a juice prep or like a meal prep type yes. thing for them so we can have them on the daily yes and just so we can get our vitamins and minerals and all that exactly. good stuff you yes know? so we'll um for sure do that like in a vlog and then i got this little um carrying thing it's like a cute little you can do like treats or cupcakes in here summer's coming up so if i ever get invited to like a friend's house like um last yeah. night i went to my friends i didn't prepare nothing but if i do prepare some sweet treats or anything i can just put them in this cute little case mm -hmm. um or like a sheet cake yeah a sheet cake whatever um it's this was 7.99 so i thought this was really cute and it's also like a cute little like, pastel pink which is obviously or my favorite like your, or like your spinach artichoke my dip. spinach artichoke dip yeah. yep yep and i just think it's so f like easy like just Damn. carrying it you know so i love that and then i also got oh you guys saw the strawberry pillows Mm -hmm. back there so yeah that's all that we got um some good purchases for sure um we've been filming for 13 minutes i know and we probably have another 30 to go yeah a few minutes later yummy 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 she like the we forgot to ask well she forgot to ask for without the head that was my bad but it has more flavor just want to say throw that out there i don't like the eyes look at them not for me. Like, 
love you. Really? And then it like squirted, but it's the juice. It's the, it's the juice. It's the seasoning. <laughs> Back home from dinner, we also did go to Target. Didn't vlog there, but I will give you guys a little haul. But the craziest thing happened. I got recognized inside Target and it was like just the sweetest interaction and I still cannot believe it. We were just like chatting and she was just so cool. I also felt so bad because we literally just ate a huge like seafood shrimp boil probably so like garlic and onions and like all this sauce and i was like girl i just like ate my weight in seafood boil so i'm so sorry if i stink <laughs> but she was just super sweet so i was just like just so nice and just a really great experience and i'm just super thankful for you that watch my channel and that i was just following along my journey also if you're in austin or anything and if you happen to see me please don't feel like you're ever bothering me like i promise it's like the biggest honor it's so funny because me and my friend star were talking about this today like there was this influencer I met back in like 2015, I think it was. And I actually met her while I was working for the radio station. And I saw her at a concert that I was working. And I like went and asked for a photo, like super chill interaction, like chill setting, I should say. And she was like, gave me just like the biggest attitude, super like stank face, like not about it. And I was like a really big fan of hers. And she's like a very big, huge blogger and like one of the OG, like, bloggers you know like fashion bloggers and it was like really like disheartening and very sad so don't ever feel like you're a bother if you happen to see me you know nowhere near that magnitude but if you ever happen to see me i would love to chat with you but yeah that was just so sweet and i'm very very thankful so y'all also know that i'm on my health journey but i think today's i guess i'm considering it my cheat day since i ate that seafood boil and i was like you know what i deserve a sweet treat and i really wanted crumble well i forgot crumbles close on sundays because i guess they like restart their new recipes like for the week so i never really pay attention to like Target's like deli section or like their bakery. I don't know why I just have never like looked through it. I saw this beauty, okay? It is a, sorry if you hear Ranger, he's always drinking water if you can hear him. It's a little mini bite size of cakes. Look at this. Tell me this is not the best thing ever. There is vanilla, double chocolate, and red velvet, which I just realized red velvet is basically chocolate dyed red. I think so. I don't know. It sounds amazing, and this is going to be me and Matthew's little treat tonight. We also got some mushrooms for breakfast tomorrow and an onion because I have this ginormous sweet potato, so I think I'm going to do like a little sweet potato scramble deal with some eggs. And then I love kombucha, but like, this is my favorite kombucha. It's the Health Aid Pink Lady Kombucha. My biggest, like my toxic treat, I guess, is I always buy the big glass bottles and I never finish it because I don't think I know how many ounces it is. I cannot finish the whole, like, container in one sitting. These are perfect because they're 11 ounces for a can. This is just perfect for an evening if I need something to help settle my stomach, if I just wanna have one before I go to bed or something. So I love that they have these now. So literally best thing ever, perfection. And then we also grabbed a picture frame because we need a picture frame for one of our prints. We just got a regular black frame and I think that's actually it we did a really good this target trip wow and this is a package that i think it's just in this is just a little amazon package that i think i know what it is i think it's just like a bed skirt that i ordered uh, this is just a regular bed skirt that i just ordered because i don't know if y'all ever noticed or i've shown that under our bed matthew has his guitars and it's like all in the open, so I just got this to cover that. So yeah, I think I actually just might go ahead and end this vlog here. It is 10.35. We have been out and about literally all day, and I am. I'm exhausted. If I sound like a little loopy, a little, a little crazy, it's because my social battery is literally like... That's me right now. But I will say, I was so overjoyed over the moon for my interaction today at Target. I was like, keep it cool, Darlene. Keep it cool. Keep it cool. Don't be weird. Don't be weird. And she was just so sweet. So I'm just so happy about that. But yeah. But thank you for watching this little weekend in my life. If you like my new upload schedule, let me know in the comments. I will see you in my next one. But thank you guys so much for watching this vlog. I will see you so soon in my next vlog. Bye.